This is a 2019 Highland Ridge Open Range 328 BHS travel trailer, bunkhouse floor plan. Uh, it's got four slides, weighs in at just over 9,000 pounds uh, with no cargo, no water, with a gross vehicle weight rating of 11,300 pounds. Uh, I have a Pro Pride hitch on here that's not included, but we can negotiate that if you like. It is the best hitch that you can get. Uh, two 30 pound tanks up front, one chassis battery, slam latch doors on the storage bays with magnetic latches. Um, inside there is where the inverter for the uh, refrigerator is. Nice big awnings, in good shape, no tears. back we have the outdoor kitchen blackstone is not included uh, but you got a good size refrigerator gas cooktop here and um, a sink that's plumbed into the gray tanks electric stabilizer jacks front and rear you got your water bay back here with your uh, black tank flushes for both your black tanks as well as your city and freshwater fill here. Cable hookups, 110 outlet, things like that. Ladder access to the walk-on roof. Frameless windows, which is pretty cool looking. Looks good. Uh, stair mats to help keep the dirt out of your trailer and it's a little bit easier on the kids getting in and out. As soon as you walk into the right, the master bedroom with the king bed. It does have its own AC unit in here. Plenty of overhead storage. Big closet. This is one of the slides. outlets and USB charging points on either side of the bed. This is the first of two bathrooms. This is the full bath with a good sized shower and glass sliding doors with an upgraded uh, Oxygenics shower head. Decent little closet space there for your towels and Vanity, access to your hot water heater through there as well, uh, porcelain toilets, and this has got its own door there, as well as access through here. In the middle of the trailer you got the kitchen. 23 cubic feet, I believe. Residential fridge with water and ice. Lots of counter space. Nice deep sink with a pull down faucet. It's a typical microwave and oven configuration. More drawers. So plenty of storage in the kitchen. Then you got your nice big couch in the slide here that converts to a queen bed with an air mattress that's included in it. Lots of overhead storage there. All pointing at a uh, good sized TV with a DVD player and sound bar. And in the back you've got the bunk room with four bunk beds. All a really nice size. We sleep four kids back here, but you can sleep adults comfortably as well. Storage down below. Location for a TV. Good amount of 
closet space there with some drawers. And quite unique is a half bath in the back. Again, porcelain toilet. Residential fridge uh, runs on an inverter that's in the front storage bay. So it does stay powered while you're driving down the road. Your control panel for all your uh, lights, fans, awnings, uh, your tank levels, and all your slide switches, water pump, hot water heater controls, things like that. This does have a ducted air throughout, so you don't have a big noisy unit trying to cool the whole trailer. Uh, it's nice and quiet. It's called a whisper quiet unit. Previously a coat closet. This was converted into a pantry. It's a lot more useful. I don't have them installed. They're stowed away right now, but you can put two tables here. So this trailer is in really good condition, uh, practically new, tires are in good shape, uh, roof is in good shape, all the interior and cabinets are in excellent shape, no issues at all whatsoever with this coach so far. If you have any questions or you want any pictures of anything else, just let me know. Thanks.